loop in here on the East Coast Trail um, going from the Spurwink Trail. It goes from Aquafort to Vermeuse. I'm going to go about halfway to the Gallagher's Cove campsite, about nine kilometers. I'm on the old Southern Shore Highway bridge here. Beautiful. Hi right, guys, beautiful day today. Uh, one of the few sunny days in the last two weeks. Beautiful area here. Uh, just out in the open here now. Some uh, windmills there in the background. Fairly new, uh, I think about two or three years ago they put them up. At the White Horse River, just a small little river crossing. Good source for water, but I have lots there now. Fairly muddy trail today, too. A lot of rain the last two weeks. Two weeks. Seems to be I'm into the drier part now, heading uphill again. I plan on doing about it. I think it's nine kilometers today. We'll see. Guys, this is a tough trail. It says it's difficult. I'm gone about two hours now. A lot of uphill. Uh, pretty rough and wet. But it's fun. Well gang, I made it to Bruin Cove. Uh, I've checked my map here in a second and I think I'm about five kilometers in. Any spot, there's a river just right here. So I'm gonna fill up with uh, fill up my water. Getting low. Bruin Cove. Nice spot for the little uh, camp. Still a nice day. It's about uh, 20 after 4. Okay, here's my water source. Perfect. Spurwink Island, and I believe that's the Fairyland Lighthouse, right above it, way off in the distance. And I believe my site is within a kilometer or so. My guys, you can see ya. Uh, Couple of lines there for lobster pots, right on the coast there. One lines there for a pot, and another one just to the right. A lot of hills on this trail, guys. A lot of hills. I'm beat. Can't wait to get to my site. Well, I think I'm just about to my site. I'm 
I'm beat. Beat, beat, beat. Hungry too. Campsite's just up there. Through the woods somewhere. And really close to the beach. So I should be able to hear the waves rolling all night. Which would be nice. I made it to the campsites. Uh, it's tent platforms. Fine for my hammock. Oh, lots of trees. Well, there's the throne. Nice view in the view there. Well, guys, I'll give you a tour of my uh, site for tonight. And it's all set up for, uh, there's four or five tent platforms. So, set up the hammock, and Hennessy, oh, backpack race in, hammock gear crow's nest under quilt. I got the zipper modification uh, mod 4 done from 2Q ZQ, a Toxway tarp from Arrowhead. Uh, there's my supplies for tonight. Little wood stove, we got an alcohol stove, minimalist, can of air, ultra pad, light, a couple of big bottles of water, kind of brown, filtered it through the, through my filter. Um, tastes fine. Alright, that's my site for tonight. Still nice and warm, uh, about 15 degrees Celsius. And it's time for supper. Hey guys, you're not supposed to have open fires here on the East Coast Trail. Um, somebody already has. So I'm going to use my uh, Farago titanium stove. Got to keep the flies down, it's crazy here. Caveman TV. Just feed a long stick in. Works perfect. Supper time. I got some uh, bluefin, nine bean and rice. I did up uh, about a month ago. Mini atomic there. Use the Virgo as a uh, windscreen. There we go. And boil up the water. I'm just going to cut this as uh, use it as a freezer bag type deal tonight. Let's clean up. So that's my uh, nine bean and rice. So I'll just 
cover that with water. I'll put it back into uh, the pot. Let it sit for probably 20 minutes. And supper's ready. Flies are crazy. And a little treat to go with it. I am Canadian. Lots of talking. Just about boiled. So I just uh, covered it with water, probably a half inch over the top. With boiling water. Give it a good stir. And Get that in the cozy. And put the lid on it. And I'll let that sit for Twenty minutes. So about five to nine. Well, it's been twenty minutes. Come out perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Cheers, gang. Tea time. <laughs> Guys, I gotta show you a pretty neat thing. Last year for Valentine's, my daughter got me these little clothespins at the dollar store. Might be a little over an inch long, inch and a half maybe. Perfect for hanging up socks, t-shirts on your uh, suspension lines. Well guys, time to hit the trail on the way home. Well guys, I'm back in Bruin Cove. Good thing because I was getting uh, low on water and it's really hot. So I used this oil squeeze, filled up my bottle, drank a liter, get my hat, nice and cool now. Oh, I got my gators on. I'm half stuck here. Oh. Thanks for the parking lot. All in all, it was a really good hike. I had a lot of fun. Got to try out new uh, mods on my hammock. Cook up some good grub. Great trip. Hope you all enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Take care. Moving out.